Good morning, guys. Uh, it's quite early for me. It's 7 a.m., but I am retro. This is again Harvest Moon DS. We're going to do a subcategory today. This is all channel sprites. Um, the goal is to just unlock all nine of the channels on the sprite stations. And we are hoping, we're hoping, we're going to PB at the very least because my current PB is with a previous strategy. It's an hour and 34 minutes. Uh, we've discovered an underflow since then, so it should be much faster. Current world record is 51.32 by Frog, who I think is here. Uh, we're gonna try to dis just destroy him, okay? All right. Well, I'm ready on time when you are, Demo. I don't have to manip the start, so <laughs> we can just go. <laughs> All right. We ready? Oh, I guess I should start my timer too. <laughs> Three, two, one. Okay. So, uh, unfortunately, we gotta sit through the intro again. That's fine. It's only five minutes. Um, all right. So, like I said, there's nine channels on the uh, Sprite Station. They're all named after planets in the solar system and also Pluto. I don't know what Pluto's status was when this game came out, but Pluto is there. Anyway, <laughs> uh, we're going to unlock two channels just by doing the intro, so that's nice. And the other ones come uh, fa fairly uh, easily. The toughest one is going to be... Um, there's a channel two for purchasing 10 uh, items on 10 different days from the supermarket. We have the festival sprite that's for attending three festivals. And then we have our uh, Pluto who it is unlocked by shipping 100,000 of a item that was produced on your farm. That used to be the most difficult part, but it's become much easier in the last what, what's it been, like two weeks <laughs> since Cody discovered this underflow? Alright, so... I, I almost had a heart attack when I saw this starting uh, items. I was like, oh no, I did it wrong, but I, I'm not, I don't need to <laughs> manipulate the RNG to start. Uh, Alright, but anyway... Um, this category has definitely evolved a lot over the last two years or so. It used to be like four to five hours of taking care of cows and milking cows. Um, then I came in about, what, a year and a half ago or something like that and introduced everyone to the concept of horse milking. Uh, we don't milk cows anymore, we milk horses. Uh, <laughs> um, and then that brought the time down quite a bit into the one and a half to two hour range. And now things are definitely far below sub one hour uh, with the milk underflow glitch, which I don't, that's, we're still debating whether that's the accurate way to describe it because it incorporates both an overflow and an underflow, but I like milk underflow glitch. It's got a nice abbreviation. All right. And I'm sorry, my voice probably sounds crazy. It's because I just woke up 30 minutes ago. <laughs> when I signed up for this time slot, it was a 9 a.m. time start for me locally. Now it's turned into seven o'clock somehow. Horse milking should be the first thing you hear when you turn on my my stream. Because <laughs> that's all I talk about. Alright, so here we are. We're going to unlock our first channel sprite. We haven't done anything. <laughs> this is Neptune, so channel 8. This is the tutorial channel. Um, it just kind of gives you basic information about the game to teach new players how to play. Uh, 
don't know how useful any of that information he has actually is. But I guess if you know nothing, it's helpful. Frantic farming is fun, yeah, but <laughs> this is my time slot, so I was I was ready to go. Here we are, our second channel sprite. This is channel one. This is, uh, what is it? Mer oh gosh, Mercury, the one I can't pronounce. <laughs> this is the weather channel, essentially. That's very useful in the run. We don't have a TV in this game. We, we have the, the sprite station instead. Okay, we're about ready to get started here. Mer Mercury, I can't say it. <laughs> All right, we're gonna sleep for quite a few days. Our goal here is to get to the 12th. We're gonna get, go give Dr. Hardy a couple of gifts because it's his birthday and we can quickly raise his friend points uh, above 100 and that'll unlock another channel sprite. I like this music too. I like Frantic Farming did have a great soundtrack. Like whatever that ending theme was, uh, was a pretty good song too. Hi, Teddy Bear. Uh, I'm not really reading the chat on my channel. I'm live on the Marathon channel if you want to go over there and join everybody else. I'm trying to keep an eye on both chats, but it's hard. All right, we're almost there. Okay. So we're gonna go out here. Thomas is ready to do the intro again. We're just gonna tell him to get lost. Okay, and Dr. Hardy likes these wild grasses, I guess because he's a doctor. So we're gonna try to grab a couple of these, go talk to him. Whoop. We just need to give him two gifts. We get extra points for gifting uh, something he likes on his birthday. That's it for today. We should unlock this bright in the morning. All right. So today we're gonna do quite a bit of stuff to get our money that we're gonna need. We don't need very much money because I'm, in my current route, I'm gonna opt to not, um, not do the uh, kappa hat. I don't think I need it. So Thomas is going to give us this ball that we uh, can never get rid of. All right. I'm going to grab a few sticks and because I have some extra time today while I'm going to wait for a van to open. Um, and I'll set up a trap. Oh no, my hands are shaking for where my horse is going to be. All right, now I need to get some things to sell to Van, um, just to get us a little bit of money so that we can do um, a quick purchase glitch. I'm also gonna pick up some weeds and stuff. Ugh, I didn't get very many flowers. That's all right. I have extra time. I just need about 10 weeds. Um, because I need to ship a thousand items so uh, I can supplement that with some weeds. And we have until 10, so I'm just gonna go around and grab a few more, I guess. This should be more than enough. 
We'll just go wait now. Okay. Ben is upstairs in the inn. He doesn't open his shop until 10 o'clock though. So we'll just hang out. All right. Thanks for stopping by, fellas. Have a good day at work. Okay, 10 o'clock. We're gonna go up here. We're going to unlock Jet really quick, because he'll help us get another channel sprite later on. We also need to, uh, within the course of the run, unlock a total of 20 sprites so that we can unlock channel 3, that's Earth. And Frog, Frog Voice will also be doing that later on, uh, much faster than I will today. Alright. I'm going to sell him this stuff. I'm gonna save, safety save. And I wish I could do the quick, quick purchase, but I can't. Okay. <laughs> uh, there we go. All right. So that was a quick purchase glitch. I bought uh, about a hundred of these botagizers, even though I didn't have very much money. This is plenty of money here. Um, that's fine. What do I need? Uh, I don't need any of this. I don't need to buy anything else. Sorry, I'm trying to read my notes. I just made these like <laughs> on Monday, so. <laughs> I just rerouted this and I don't know my route yet, but that's fine. So we're gonna go up here now, and like I said, we can talk to Jit, and that'll help us get another sprite. We're gonna buy five records from him. Okay. This is channel five. What planet is that? I don't know. It's Jupiter. <laughs> this is the DJ station. You can change the in-game music up. They have classic songs from previous Harvest Moon games. All right, let's get out of here. Go back to our farm. All right, we do need to make a call, a few calls, buy some stuff. So I'm gonna call the supermarket. I'm gonna buy one turnip seed because I need to buy 10 items. I'm gonna buy the uh, rucksack upgrade. That should be all I need from there. Now I'm gonna call the blacksmith. I'm gonna buy a milker and a brush. This will allow me to do the milking glitch with the horse. And now we're gonna call a poultry barn. We're gonna buy about a thousand of this feed. Three, four, five, six. I'm so slow today. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. We're not going to ship those today. We're going to go to sleep. We're going to sleep for a few days. <laughs> no corner cutting more. I was corner cutting a little bit. What do you mean? <laughs> I'm saving all kinds of frames. All right. Anyway, we have to sleep quite a bit because we have to get to three festivals. So we'll just... Uh, Keep going here. I tried at about the 19th if it's sunny. I guess I could do it today too. Okay. Now we're gonna go out. We're gonna ship all this stuff. Oh my gosh. My button pressing is like so suboptimal today. <laughs> All right, 
So now we've shipped a thousand items. This is Fra. You're just a normal sprite, but he's gonna, he means that we can trigger the unlock for uh, the horse, and the horse will be very important later on. So let's go inside and pop back out to do that. Alright. So Takir brings us a horse he found. Lucky for us, this horse is currently lactating. We're gonna keep him, I, or her. I guess it's a her, huh? <laughs> okay, so let's grab the horse. And we're gonna stick it in this trap we have here. I'm gonna clear some inventory space, sort this out. And we're gonna start leveling the milker. Basically, we just have to use the tool in the air over and over again. Um, we have to do that about, I think it's like 700 to 800 times. <laughs> uh, takes about 15 real world minutes of mashing the Y button, but and that's what we're going to be doing for the next like 15 minutes. <laughs> but we have to get this up to level 99. And we're also right now we're waiting until the supermarket opens at 9 so we can buy an item from them to count towards a channel 2 sprite, of course. Okay. Oh, I'm just, it doesn't matter what I buy now, I'm just gonna buy some turnip seeds. And I think, yeah, I'll have to buy the rucksack upgrade at some point. Alright, let's sleep a few more days and we're gonna do that again. Uh, I don't have that written down to buy the rucksack upgrade, but I do need to do that at some point. Basically, I, I don't want to go out and do this on a Monday, Tuesday, Saturday, or Sunday, or a holiday. So, um, I can do it tomorrow if it's sunny. Good. Let's go out here, and we're just going to stand here and mash Y again until 9 o'clock. Yeah, I don't know what the time frame is. That's why I didn't bother to check on the last day. I was like, I know it's not ready yet. I, maybe it's like a week in game after you buy the first upgrade that the second one appears. I don't know exactly though. Good morning, Desert. Thank you. All right, we are, we're going to try to avoid looking at the progress bar for this milker because it, <laughs> like I said, takes 15 real world minutes. That's a very long time. Okay, and I kind of need to pay attention a little bit here at the end because I want to max my fatigue out. If you go to bed, oh gosh, I don't know the exact numbers. If you go to bed after nine o'clock, with higher than 97 fatigue. Hold on, I have to count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You will wake up at eight o'clock the next day instead of six. So we're gonna try to uh, not mess up and we're gonna try to manipulate that. <laughs> Let me see if the Rexx ready. Yeah, I'll buy that today. Okay, so now we should wake up instead of at six o'clock like normal, we should wake up at eight. Cool. So now we just mash again until nine. We only have to wait one hour instead of three hours, so that's cool. Okay. 
That's not super necessary to do this, but I like it. It's just less waiting. <clears throat> I'm sorry, my voice is still terrible. Oops. Okay, supermarket again, buy another item. That's true as well, Frog. Okay, so we're gonna do this little chain, <clears throat> sorry, <laughs> this chain a few more times until we have bought our 10 items. So let's head into summer. I, I hate the summer music, but we gotta deal with it for a little bit. In summer, we also need to make sure that um, we check the weather for the next day because if we have a typhoon, then it does us no good to wake up at eight o'clock. Let's try today. I guess I could have gone out that day. All right, so let's use the channel, make sure that the weather is going to be good. Oh, it's not. So let's forget about that. All right, so we'll have to do a more item buying after the festival. That's okay. All right, that's gonna throw me off just a little bit, but it's okay. So summer 7th is gonna be our first um, festival. It's a chicken festival, isn't it? <laughs> I think. And we're going to go to the festival, but we're gonna immediately pass out. So I need to, on the way there, try to find a red grass or two. Oh gosh, I don't see any, so that's scary. Yeah, this is not good. There's one, I'll just, that's okay, it will be fine. I have time. I just need to be really careful and make sure that I'm counting once we get uh, our fatigue high. All right, so again, I'm gonna level this until 10 o'clock when the festival starts. I'm gonna try to max out my fatigue again. And as soon as we step onto the beach to do the festival, I'm gonna eat this red grass I have, which will cause me to pass out. That still counts as me attending the festival. It's just a little bit faster than going through the festival dialogue. And this is something we discovered from watching a Japanese Taz of this game. Okay, I'm mashing as like fast as I possibly can. Because it took me way too long to find that red grass, but it's okay. And getting a little bit of extra leveling in by going over time is really not a bad thing either. Because we, like I said, we got to do this 700 times, so. Okay. Now I need to count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, and I need to, I'm so paranoid that I'm gonna <laughs> miscount there. All right. So there's that done. I think today would be a good day to go out if we can. Check the weather again. Okay, good. So we're gonna stay the course again, max our fatigue out. All right, I'm gonna peek at the bar just once. Okay, so see this milker level, we gotta get that gray bar all the way up. And then we got to do it 99 more times to level to 99. Yes, he does actually take about half of your money. So uh, we might cut it close with the money, but <laughs> we should be okay.
And again, I need to count once we get up here. I can use it nine more times once this skull appears. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I don't mind sacrificing 20 minutes on this day to save two hours on the other day. Buy some seeds. All right. Now we wait till nine again. My hand is already tired. <laughs> Okay, we've got a, a couple more rounds of doing this same thing. There's another storm. Luckily our horse doesn't mind being out there in a typhoon. <laughs> Try on Wednesday here, see if we can do it again. Again, I'm gonna go out, check the weather. Good. Doesn't matter if it rains the next day, I just can't have a typhoon. So I've bought, is it four, five, six? Six items so far. Yeah, I don't know what happened. My computer froze or, IB, or OBS crashed. Shoot. My captures messed up too. Hang on. <laughs> uh, I have to... Hold on, I gotta turn the volume down so I can focus. My, <laughs> I gotta close my capture software, I guess, and reopen it, I don't, I don't know. Well, that sucks. Okay. And I'd have no idea where I'm at in terms of uh, fatigue here, so hopefully I don't, mess this up but <laughs> oops I did mess it up well that's okay <laughs> all right so we are probably really messed up and my uh video is probably already invalid <laughs> it's okay I'm just gonna do it today uh that sucks well 
I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what happened either. OBS crashed or my computer froze totally because I couldn't do anything there. Because my timer froze too. Or at least it did on the OBS screen. I don't know whether it actually froze. No idea. Oh, well. <laughs> this marathon is just... Um... <laughs> It's just causing everybody issues. We're uh, powering through, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, I'm not sure. I guess I can turn the music back up because I was, I, you know, it's like when you uh, need to focus, you have to turn everything down so you can see better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, buying another item. <laughs> I'm actually like, now I'm pretty confused about where I'm at. <laughs> I lost it. Okay. Getting there. Again, we're waiting till nine. I didn't even check the weather today, so that's probably a problem. Uh, well, it could have been bad, but it's okay. Buy another one. Going to the next festival. It's on the 20th. All right, again, we need to try to find a grass, a red grass. Uh, oops, whoops. Try to get a couple, but there aren't many to be found. Okay, we're good, we're gonna wait till 10. Devin. I'm already, uh, my split is red, so that's frustrating me, but it's okay. <laughs> All right. We had a minor mishap earlier, but we're recovering. My voice is still <laughs> very morningy. Okay. Let's check this out again. We're getting there. We're gonna lose some more money today for passing out at the festival. It's okay. I'm counting again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Thank you for the good luck. All right. So we need to do another round of uh, buying a couple of items from the supermarket, leveling a bit more, I suppose. Uh, well, no. I have to be careful of um, festivals as well. Like I would do it today, but I think they're closed for the fireworks festival on the 24th. So I'll wait.
Um, this day is fine though. Let's just do this. All right. I have to stop promising records. That's my problem. If I just keep my mouth shut <laughs> and not, <laughs> not promise that stuff, I'd be fine. Weird things keep happening though, so. Peak again at our level, we're getting there. Okay, we just need two more items for channel two. Me? Yeah, I am too. I am one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, yeah, I probably deserve it. <laughs> Listen, okay. I'm one of the best at this game, if not the best, and that's not my fault, okay? I should have checked the weather for this day too, but I didn't. Well, I'm just taking risks all over the place today. All right, let's buy our final item. Oops, ah, didn't get accidental misconnection glitches all the time. <laughs> I hate that. Okay, so here we have channel two, TV shopping. I lost four and a half minutes on that split. <laughs> that seems a little excessive, but anyway, this is how this is the channel where you buy your items like the big bed and your kitchen and that kind of thing. Okay. Now I have it that we go to Autumn 8th. Everyone should get good at this game because it's a good game. <laughs> Hopefully it's not um, like rainy. Maybe I'll pop down a save just to be um, super safe. Safety saving time. Hi Quark, good morning. I'm glad to see you. <laughs> Hope for good weather because I don't know how to max my fatigue in the rain because I never do it. Okay, it says, oh, I have to do this cutscene, of course. But I'm just doing this to max my fatigue because I need a little bit more leveling. I want to max my fatigue so I get closer to the time that the uh, festival is supposed to start. We're pretty much there though. I might be over leveled because I passed out accidentally when my everything froze. <laughs> oh, the red split is real though. It's okay. I 
All right, so now our milker is leveling by one level each time we use it. It shouldn't do that. That's a glitch in the 1.0 version of uh, this game. But it's helpful for us because it means we can get more bottles of milk for each time we milk later on. Yeah, this was probably unnecessary to do this this day, but it's okay. <laughs> We're gonna be over leveled. Okay, counting again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't have to buy an item, I can just go straight to bed. And we'll wake up for the festival. Let's see if we can't grab another grass just for some safety. There's one. Um, I'll go grab this mushroom too, just in case. I shouldn't need it, but that's all right. So unfortunately, I do need to try to max my fatigue. I could eat that stuff if I need to. I might do that. I might poison myself real quick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm losing a bit of time and I'm probably over leveling. Yeah, I am. So I'm already at 99, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Everything is not going perfectly, but this should be our third festival. So we're gonna get another channel sprite. This is Saturn. They tell you about um, upcoming festivals and stuff like that. All right. Now we can get to the horse milking. Uh, let's do it today, I guess. I need to get this weed out of the way. Oops. Okay, so let's bring our brush over here. We're gonna brush the horse and then switch to the milker. And then I'm going to move that stack of 100 milk into my inventory. I need to do this just 29 times. I used to have to do it a thousand times, but <laughs> we've made improvements. Okay. So basically, this is um, again a glitch. I switch from the brusher, from the brush to the milker, and the game thinks I've used the milker on an animal that it produces milk, which I did not. You can do this once a day on other brushable animals like cows and sheep, but with the horse, for some reason, you can do it an infinite number of times per day. Take my brush over here. Oops. And I have a crack on my touch screen right over where I um, swap these tools. So that's a problem, but it's okay. I did this during a previous Channel Sprites run. All right. By shipping all of these milks later on, it's going to unlock two more channel sprites. Okay, we're almost done. A couple more. I'm going to save after this in case I mess it up again by trying to be too quick. Alright, 
So now this is a milk underflow glitch. I'm going to combine these stacks to make a super stack. Right now this stack that says like X number is a stack of over 100 milks, which shouldn't be possible, but oops, I'm sleeping. It is, let's see, bring it over here. Keep doing that until I get a uh, milk that is 128 milks. The game does not recognize a number that big. It sees it as a uh, negative number, actually. So I've just shipped negative 128 milks, but the game can interpret a negative number like that. So the number of milks shipped underflows to the maximum, which is a billion. So we gotta go through Gut's dialogue here, because he thinks we've shipped a billion milk, so he's gonna keep congratulating us for hitting all these milestones. That's 10 million. This will be a hundred million. And I just have to ship something to trigger all of these cutscenes and we're gonna trigger some sprite unlocks too. They'll count towards our channel three uh, for doing uh, tw unlocking 20 other sprites. So here we go. Guts is done congratulating us, so now we've started to move on to the sprites. The harvest team, this is Kevin for just shipping anything in the horse. Whoops. Whoops. Oops. Yeah, it is cool. <laughs> it's like three or four different glitches at once because it's the milk leveling it's the tool switch and tool switch glitch um for whatever reason the horse acts different than other tool switch glitch things and then the under overflow and the underflow And I will tell you that in my practice run, <laughs> my time was a 46.31. So that's not happening today. And I did have that um, freeze or crash or whatever earlier. So this is probably invalid, but that's okay. We'll just do it again another time and we'll do it better. Now we've moved on to the animal team sprites. There's a few, oh my gosh, I keep hopping on the horse. My R button is just not cooperating with me this morning. <laughs> and ironically enough, the last sprite we're gonna get will be Earth. <laughs> I'm gonna stick around after uh, Lana's run because Frog Voice is gonna do another short category of this game. All right, channel sprite, our final one, or not final one, but we have three more. <laughs> this is channel four, this just gives you information about your animals. I'll let you know when your animals are sick and uh, stuff like that. All right, one more item to ship to unlock channel 9, Pluto. Those are for shipping 100,000 items produced on your farm. It's like a quiz show channel. They ask you questions about previous Harvest Moon games and you can, uh, you win some sort of prize. I don't know what it is. Oh, I get out of here. I just need to unlock another sprite. So I'll go over here for Karaf. And this should trigger Earth unless I've messed something up, <laughs> which is entirely possible. All right, you ready on time? There we go.
All right, so this is Channel 3 Earth. He gives information about how to find other um, <laughs> sprites. <laughs> and there we go. All nine of our channel sprites, we finished up the Harvest Sprite Station. Just like that. Uh, <laughs> that's definitely a PB if it counts, but... <laughs> I know, I'm sorry, Frog. We should have set it up so you could do uh, all channel sprites too, and you could. I was locally recording, but I don't know if it counts because my capture software did kind of crash too. Uh, but that's all right. <laughs> we'll figure it out. I can do it again. It's much easier to do this again than it used to be. So. <laughs>